You have to own your own happiness. Uh, take it away from other people demanding that they make you happy. You want to know how to decide if a career opportunity is a good one. There are several things you have to take into consideration. Number one, does it make your heart sing? The number one feedback system that you are given at birth is joy. If you're not experiencing joy as you, as you think about doing something and as you pursue doing it, then it's off course for you. And you will begin to see it reflect itself in all the dimensions of your life, your mental life, your physical life, your social life, in your relationships, your monetary life. So concentrate on developing yourself. Because if you don't, I guarantee you that you will make a settlement, and most people have. In addition to working on yourself, and as you work on yourself, you feel good about yourself, and as you feel better about yourself, you treat yourself differently. Develop a health plan. See, you can't feel well and do well if you don't have good health. You can't perform if you don't have your health. Your health is valuable. Develop a health plan. A plan that you will follow because this is the only vehicle that you have to carry you through this experience called life. It's take no less than 100% responsibility for your life. You know, one of the greatest myths that's pervasive in our culture today is that you're entitled to a great life and that somehow, somewhere, someone is responsible for filling our lives with continual happiness and exciting career options, and nurturing family and blissful personal relationships simply because we exist. But the real truth is that there's only one person responsible for the quality of your life and that person is you. And we all been through great things, you know what I'm saying? It's just about, I think my message now is for everybody to find happiness and joy. I've told you this um, years ago on your show that I've been searching for happiness and joy, even though I'm super blessed and we got life. The next thing is, see yourself there. How will you feel once you get there? What will the experience be like for you? What will be different? What kind of person do you have to become in order to get there? Visualize yourself there, living the experience. You want to see yourself beyond your circumstances. You've got a challenge, see yourself beyond your challenge. See yourself with the challenge already resolved. And knowing that all is well, seeing yourself in control and in charge of your destiny, being healthy and happy. Sometimes you can go and do an internship or you can work for a friend in their restaurant just to see if you like it because often the fantasy doesn't match the reality. And the other thing is to simply